So what does this all mean? This plastic is getting into the body. It's getting into the men's reproductive system. Specifically, that's what we're talking about now. We have a fertility crisis. Men experience 50 to 60% decline in sperm counts from 1973 to 2011. And according to a 2017 study that was published in Human Reproductive Data. So once again, 50% reduction pretty much per generation. What's going to happen as that gets lower and lower? And this is just a man, not counting women's reproductive issues. So women's exposure, let's talk about what, what's happened to women when they get exposed to these plastics. Um, phthalates, this is one of these uh, endocrine disrupting chemicals. There's microplastics, there's phthalates, there's a bisphenol A, there's many different types of them. Phthalates are used in a lot of, of cosmetics, body conditioning uh, products, hair products. And if women are exposed to phthalates during pregnancy, it's linked to something called the male baby's anogenital distance. Now, who came up with this? I don't know. The distance between the anus and the base of the penis, the higher exposure is associated with a shortened anogenital distance, so it's closer together. Later in life, the shorter uh, anal, uh, anogenital uh, distance is linked to smaller penis, poorer sperm quality, and it, it's such that if, if, if they're exposed to this at birth, it can affect their ability to reproduce.